Hey, 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 we are at intellectualradio.com. This is Sarah of the Crazy Chicks, and I am here with Mr. Kevin Shine himself. Welcome back to Chicago. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So you have to tell the audience what brings you here today. Um, you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, of course, of course. No, I'm just kidding. But um, tell us a little bit about the event that you have coming up, just uh, briefly. December 23rd. It's going to be at the Velvet Lounge. It's called Business as Usual. Um, it's a basically a showcase, a forum, and we're also going to be having a charity. We're going to be uh, definitely taking care of Pacific Guard Mission. We're going to be trying to raise, you know, feed between 700,000 families. And we also have a nonprofit that I, I work with called For the People, By the People. And we're trying to raise $5,000 for them to help them, you know, with their programs. They basically um, help provide jobs for people who don't have jobs and, and programs to get kids off the street. That's what's up. That's what's up. So how do people find you? How can people locate you uh, as far as the Internet and everything is concerned? Um, Twitter, of course. Uh, Kevin underscore the letter A, the letter N, the letter R underscore Shine, S-H-I-N-E. It's always the best way. And then um, if you want to submit music, because, of course, I work in the music industry, I'm always looking for talented songwriters and singers. Um, and I kind of started focusing more on singers because I just didn't feel like they had a platform. And that's something that I'm also kind of incorporating into this event. So you, you definitely out there and you sing or you, um, you write. Um, I would definitely love to hear you. Um, the uh, email is writing sessions, the letter K, the uh, writing sessions, the letter K, the letter S at gmail.com. And you can send me some. Are you looking for people? Is that all the time or do you have certain times of the season that no, you're no, always? No, no, I mean, all the time. I mean, actually, the, the, you know, um, the whole, you know, like right now we're a process of, of um, talking, uh, negotiating a television project. Okay. And uh, we're going to be centering it around singers and songwriters. So, okay. I'm, I'm, you know, it's something that I just kind of feel like, you know, um, the whole inspiration for that show came because I just wanted to create a platform that would really echo to the, you know, the masses. You know, I just, we're always looking for a vehicle. So I, I created a program and um, some people are talking to me. Okay, is there an age requirement for this? For this this event, yes. Uh, for this particular event, you got to be 21. But I'm saying for people that are sending you music. Oh, no, 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 never, 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 never. I mean, actually, um, I, I I found and signed a, a, a young, just incredible artist named Jacob Lattimore when he was 12 years old. So, and, you know, at the time I was working under uh, Wayne Williams over at Job, and I really, really told Wayne this is an artist I felt would be the next. So when I look, you know, when I see um, Jacob in the movie headline, it just brings it all back. So my aunt, she's only 50 years older than Jacob Lattimore, and she's just looking, she just got a keyboard player, and she's looking to start out. How about, where do I send that to you as well? Of course. Yeah, so she's 71. That's yeah. my aunt Barbara. She were looking you know, at because, Well, you know, it, you never know. I mean, you never know. You, uh, you know, you remember that record? Nah, nah, nah. Uh -huh. that, was, that lady wasn't young at all. Yeah, <laughs> and I don't know where the guy is that did the drop your pants, drop your pants. But, no, I'm just, I'm just messing with you. But I will be sending you some of my Aunt Barbara's uh, music. But thank you so, so much for uh, visiting no, Intellectual. No, I want to thank you. Um, very incredible lady here. I've been knowing her a lot, a lot of years. And she's always given and her heart to not just the community but to the youth so hey and you've been in the business so you know what i'm talking about yeah, sometimes you. we have to step back and and look at what we're what we're doing and give back to those who don't get to where we yeah, got to that's true thank you so much thank you